Do you like my new coat? It looks terrific. How much was it? Eighty dollars. Where did you get it? At Sears. What's the temperature? It's seventy degrees Fahrenheit. Is it cold out? Yes, it's cold and windy. Good idea. Where are you going? To the post office. Would you buy some stamps for me? Sure. How many do you want? Ten. Here's the money for the stamps. Do you like snow? No, I hate it. How far is it to work? Six miles. Are we going to get a lot of snow? About twelve inches, they say. I will. By the way, can I borrow your car? Yes. When is your vacation? It starts next week. Where are you going? We're renting a house on the shore. Do you swim a lot? Not very much. Who are you playing with? Some friends from work. Are you a good soccer player? Yes, but I'm not the best player on the team. What time does the game begin? Nine o'clock. Why don't you come with me? I can't today. I'm very busy. How old is she? She's sixteen. What's your cousin's name? Kathy. I'm going to her house after dinner. How old is she? She's twenty-four. Is she pretty? Yes, and she's very nice too. Is she single? No, she's married and she has two children. What are you getting Jim for his birthday? I don't know yet. How about a briefcase? Good idea. His briefcase is getting old. Hello, is Mary there? I'm sorry, you have the wrong number. Oh, is this two three four six seven eight nine? No, it's not. Would you like anything else? You haven't eaten very much. No thanks, I'm already full. How do you take it? With sugar, please. No cream. What's a bidet? It's like a toilet, only better. I'll let you figure it out. Are there any plates? Yes, there are. Are there any chairs in here? No, there aren't. But there are some in the living room. Where is your meeting? In Dallas, Texas. How are you go to? By plane. Do you like to fly? Sure, it's fast and comfortable. What flight are you taking? Flight two o seven. And your name, please. Henry Chandler. Are you free Friday night? I might not be in town. I am not sure yet. A friend suggested I go to Vancouver. What are you thinking of doing? We're not sure yet. We might go to a bar, but we'll probably go to see AI. How are you? Good, thank you. How's your new job? I started working today. How does it seem so far? It's demanding, but I'm happy to be working. What's your boss like? He appears to be very thoughtful and kind. But they all do at first. I guess we'll have to see. Do you see my car keys? They're on top of the TV. Where are you going? To the supermarket. Again? Yes, we eat a lot. 
Do you want me to go with you? Sure, if you can. Is your bank near here? Yes, it's only four blocks away on Vine Street. Are you sure? It's not out of your way? No, not at all. Why don't you go lie down? I'll bring you some aspirin. When can I see Dr. No? He won't be free until tomorrow. Can I make an appointment? Sure. Can you make it at 9 o'clock? I'll check to see if he's available. I'm sorry, but he's tied up until 10 o'clock. Waiter, could we have the bill, please? Yes. Can I put it all in one bill? No, we prefer separate checks. Would you check it again, please? Sorry, ma'am. This is your friend's bill. Here is yours. It's $24.16. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like some information about buses, please. Where to? To Toronto. When? This Saturday. Morning or afternoon? In the afternoon. About three o'clock. May I help you? Yes, may I speak to David Waller, please? How do you spell your last name? V-A-L-E What's your phone number? Or does Mr. Waller have it? Uh, no, he doesn't. It's 456-5678. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? 4565678. Oh, doctor, how is he? Well, I'm afraid we'll have to operate. Oh, doctor, do you really have to? I'm afraid so. He's lost a lot of blood. If we don't operate, he'll die. Why do you need a loan? I have to buy a new car. What's wrong with your car? It won't start, and it's ten years old. How much will a new car cost? About $15,000. What kind of work do you do? I'm a cashier at a supermarket. Do you like your job? No, it's not very interesting. How are you settling in? Oh, we're still in a bit of a mess, but Lisa seems to like it here. Is there a garden for her to play in? Yes, it's not very big, but we've got a small swimming pool. Have you found a school for Jerry? Yes, there's one near here. It only takes five minutes by car. So you like it there, do you, Neil? Yes, this is a very good place for my children. Is there a bakery near here? Yes, you can get there in five minutes. Why are you going to the bakery? To buy a birthday cake. Whose birthday is it? My daughter's. She's ten. Will you get some bread for me? Sure. Do you want anything else? No, thanks. I'll pay you when you get back. What exactly are you looking for? I'm not sure, really. Perhaps you can help me. What's the stone? It's a ruby, sir, and it's only $1,200. How old is she? She'll be seven years old on Sunday. What about a Barbie doll set? I don't think so. She has many Barbie dolls. Have you got anything educational? You see, she's a very intelligent girl. 
I've got the perfect thing, a do-it-yourself kit where you can build your own Barbie doll who rides a skateboard. Can I get some tickets for plays? Yes. What plays are on tonight? Cats, but it's all sold out. Are there any seats left for tomorrow night? Yes. How many tickets do you want? Two, please. Where would you like to sit? I'm not sure. How much is it in the middle section? Fifty dollars. How much is it in the back? Thirty-five dollars. What time does the play start? At seven o'clock. What time will the play be over? At nine thirty. Are you ready? Grace is still in her room. What time does the movie begin? It starts at seven thirty. What time is it now? About seven ten. I thought that movie was terrific. Didn't you? I don't know. It didn't seem to have any meaning. I see you're reading Harry Potter. How do you like it? I can't put it down. Have you read it? Yes. In fact, I just finished it. The ending's great. Mr. Adams, have you seen this ad in the recruit news? Yes, I saw it, but I'm not interested in finding a new job. Do you smoke? I've never known that. When did you start smoking? I started smoking when I was eighteen. So how long have you been a smoker? I've smoked for twenty years. How many cigarettes do you smoke a day? I smoke two packs of cigarettes a day. Have you ever tried to quit? Yes, I have quit twice. Once when I was expecting my baby Paul, and the other time when I had a bad sore throat. But I had a hard time. Did you hear about the Smith family? No. What happened? Had she been suffering from heart disease? Yeah, Mrs. Smith had it for five years before she died. Did they try surgery? She had two operations, but they weren't effective. Have you heard about the good news in the Wallace family? No, I've been out of town. But they already have a little girl, don't they? No, they have a five-year-old boy. So they wanted a girl this time, right? Yes, they wanted a girl for a long time. Was it natural childbirth? No, she had to have a cesarean. What are you doing here, Timothy? I don't believe it. I'm going to see my daughter. She will marry this weekend. How about you? When is your daughter's wedding? Sunday. Where is your train leaving from? My train leaves from platform three over there. How have you been? Good. I hear you've been to Toronto for a few days. Did you have a nice visit? Really nice. It was very good for going around downtown and shopping. You've met Stanley, haven't you? Sure, I met him when he was here in Hamilton last year. What is he doing these days? Yes, as a matter of fact, he just began to teach elementary school. Have you met my nieces? Yes, they visited you once in the summer, didn't they? What do you feel like eating this morning? 
I usually just have a bowl of cereal. What do you make? All I make is oatmeal, toast, and some orange juice. What are you going to have for breakfast? I'll just have some cereal each morning. What do you have for breakfast? When I need to make a quick breakfast, I just make some oatmeal toast and OJ. Would you like to make something? Yes. What do you want to eat for breakfast? All I usually have is some cereal for breakfast. Do you know that breakfast is the most important meal of the day? I sometimes run late in the morning and can't make breakfast. So are you still going to have cereal? I think I'm going to make myself oatmeal and toast. What's for lunch? I don't know. What do you want to eat? I was thinking of pizza. What do you want to eat? I wouldn't mind a burger. Where can we go to get both? We can get both at the cafeteria. What are we eating for lunch? I have no idea. What about you? I kind of want pizza. How about some burgers? I already had a burger yesterday. What are we going to do? We can just get each other what we want to get. Do you know a place that sells pizza and burgers? I think they sell both at the cafeteria. What do you feel like having? I want to get some pizza. Do you want to get a burger? See, I had a burger for lunch yesterday. How about I get pizza and you get a burger? Let's do that then. Where do they sell both at? They sell pizza and burgers at the cafeteria. What are you planning on cooking? I'm not making anything. What do you feel like having? I want some chicken and potatoes. When are you going to make it? I have no plans on cooking tonight. Are you going to cook anything? I didn't plan on cooking tonight. Are you going to cook it tonight? I'm really not going to cook tonight. What are you planning on making? I'm not cooking dinner. What do you want to eat? I have a taste for some chicken and potatoes. So are you planning on cooking it? I already told you that I'm not cooking tonight. Do you know what you want to drink? I kind of want a soda. What do you mean? When you're thirsty, you're not supposed to drink soda. What are you supposed to drink? Water is what's best for you. How about we go and get something to drink? Let's do that. Do you know what you want to get? A soda sounds good. What should I drink then? You should really drink water. How are you? Good, how are you? What is the most interesting thing about your city? Well, San Francisco has many interesting things, but the most interesting thing is probably the architecture. There are lots of very unique buildings, and the most unique building is probably the Trans America Building. It's built like a pyramid. It's nice. 
What is the most expensive area in San Francisco? Well, it is very, very expensive. The most expensive area is a place called Pacific Heights. And it's on the highest hill in San Francisco. And it overlooks the bay. It's a really, really beautiful place. What is the most beautiful place in San Francisco? Well, actually, the most beautiful place is outside the city. It's a place called Muir Woods, and it has the tallest trees in the world. And some of these trees are really old. They're the oldest trees in North America. Some of them are over 2,000 years old. Where is the cheapest place to live? The cheapest place to live is a place called Sunset. And Sunset is on the west side. And the houses are kind of old. And they're a little bit cheap. But one thing about Sunset is it has the nicest view of the ocean. And you could watch the sunset every night. That's why it's called the Sunset Area. If I wanted to go there, when is the best time to visit? Well, the best time is probably in the fall because that's when the weather is the nicest. It's not too cold and it's not too hot and it doesn't rain that much. When would be the worst time to visit? The worst time to visit would probably be February and March because February and March are the coldest and wettest months. So, well, March isn't that cold, but sometimes it's wet, so it rains a lot. I've never met your family. Do you have a big family? Yeah, kind of. There are five people in my family, so it's a medium family. I have two brothers, so there are three boys in my family, and there's my mother and my father. How about your father? Do you look like him? Yes, I do. I look like my father. When he was younger, he had blonde hair like me, and he has glasses. So do I. My mother has glasses, too. I'm the same height as my father. We are both 180 centimeters tall. My older brother is the same height as me and my father, but my younger brother is shorter than us. How tall is your younger brother? He's a bit shorter than us, I'm not sure, but I think he's around 170 centimeters tall. How about your mom? My mom is short, too. She's the same height as my brother. What about the rest of your family? Well, my mother is skinny, too, like me. But my brothers are more like my dad in their body type. They're a little bit more muscular than me. They have big muscles, and they're very strong. So they are heavier than me. That's my father. He weighs more than I do. And my brothers are also heavier than me. You told me about your family's appearance. How about their personality? Well, all five people in my family have different personalities. Yeah, my younger brother is really fun. It's great to spend time with him. For example, we usually play video games together. He likes to play racing games or sports games, and also we play card games or just watch TV. He's so funny. No matter what we're doing, he tells jokes, and I love listening to him tell jokes about whatever we're doing at the time. And he's so cheerful and bright. He's always open to new people and new ideas. So I really like spending time with him. He makes me feel cheerful to when we talk together. How about your older brother? Well, my older brother, he's a really good guy. He's not so entertaining like my younger brother, but he's very smart. 
He's really serious. He likes to study and read. For example, he likes reading the Greek philosophers. He likes reading about Plato and Socrates. And he's always talking about philosophy. I like that stuff too. I think it's interesting, but he's not very funny. How about your dad? My dad, let's see. What can I say about my dad's personality? He's a hard worker. He's very devoted to everything he tries. He was raised on a farm, so he knows a lot about animals. And now he has a farm as a hobby. My dad raises horses and chickens. He loves animals, and he has so many animals, but he doesn't think of them like farm animals. They're his pets, and he loves them. He spends every day outside, where no matter what the weather, because he has to take care of his family, which is all of his animals. And he's a really smart guy, maybe a bit serious at times. His sense of humor is maybe like you can imagine from an old man. How about your mother? What's she like? My mother loves to read horror novels, so she knows a lot of stuff about crime or mysteries or police dramas and lawyers. She loves that stuff, so my mother is very interested in that kind of book. And movies and TV shows too. She's kind of like a detective. My mother is very smart and enjoys solving puzzles. Can I ask you a favor? Sure, any time. Can I stay there then? You can. How long? Maybe a week or two weeks. When? From next Monday. How about a car? Can I park my car? Ah,、uh, that's a problem. You can't park your car because there's no space. But there's a cheap parking lot about maybe two blocks away. How about cooking? Can I cook? Of course you can cook. I have a stove and a refrigerator. You can bring your own food. You can do whatever you want. Can I use the internet? You can use the internet. There's a password. I'll write it down before I leave, and I'll write down the password before you get here. Can my friends stay over? Yeah, sure. So your friends can stay. Not a problem, I don't think. Can he bring his dog? Oh, that is a problem. Does the dog have a cage? Ah,、uh, no. But we can get a cage. How about smoking? Can he smoke outside? Yes, he can smoke outside. Just please pick up cigarette butts. But of course, he can't smoke inside. How about if we want to have a party? Can we have a party? Yeah, you can have a party. That's okay, but please be quiet. Don't be too loud. The neighbors live very close to my house. Can I use the washing machine? Yeah, of course. You can use anything. You use the washing machine. You can use the internet. You can use the TV. You can use anything you'd like. What about dresses? Do you like to wear dresses? I do like to wear dresses. In the winter, it's a good time actually to wear sweater dresses. They're warm and a dress, so it's nice for work. Have you seen a sweater dress before? I have no idea what a sweater dress is. What is a sweater dress? It's a dress, but made of sweater material. What about in the summer? In the summer, I love to wear flip flops. It's my favorite thing to wear, so I often wear flip flops with jeans or shorts, skirts again. I don't wear tights in the summer because it's too hot.
Do you wear flip-flops to work? I can't wear flip-flops to work. So when I go to work, I often wear high heels or flats, some dress shoes. Do you like to wear shorts or skirts? Which do you prefer? I prefer shorts because it's more comfortable and easy to move around. But I also can't wear shorts to work, so I have many summer skirts for work. What kind of shoes besides flip-flops do you like to wear? I do have many pairs of shoes, and so I like to wear flats and sandals, especially in the summer. In the winter, I like to wear boots and rain shoes when it rains or rain boots. When I'm exercising, I like to wear sneakers or tennis shoes because it's good for your feet. What shoes do you usually take when you travel? When I travel, I usually take flats because they're easy to remove at the airport and they're light and convenient for traveling. What shoes do you usually use? Just my sneakers. So my sneakers I wear everywhere. Now, women sometimes have accessories, you know, like earrings, necklaces, scarves, things like that. What do you like to wear? I like to wear necklaces, especially long necklaces. I don't like necklaces that are too short. It feels uncomfortable. I don't like to wear bracelets or a watch because I don't like anything on my wrist. But I do love to wear rings. I usually wear one ring on each hand, just for fashion, not for anything special. What do you do? I'm a student. I work in a bank. I'm unemployed at the moment. I run my own business. I'm retired now. I used to be an engineer. Are you married? Yes, I've been married for two years now. I'm divorced. I'm engaged. We're getting married next year. No, but I'm in a relationship. Nope, I'm single. Why are you studying English? For work. So I can communicate when I travel. I love learning new languages. Because I'd like to immigrate to the U.S. I'm thinking of studying in England. How did you learn English? I took classes for three years. I did an intensive course. I've been studying on my own. I picked it up from movies and songs. My girlfriend taught me. What do you do in your free time? I don't have any free time. I usually hang out with friends. I go running a lot. I do volunteer work. I like reading and relaxing at home. What's the weather like? Hot and humid. It's pouring. Take an umbrella. A little chilly. You might want to bring a jacket. Gorgeous. A perfect summer day. It's quite cold. Make sure to bundle up. What time is it? It's 10 o'clock. It's half past four. It's a quarter to 12. Let me check my phone. Sorry, I don't know. Can I help you? No, thanks. I'm just browsing. Yes, do you have this in a larger size? Yes, where are the try-on rooms? Yeah, can you tell me how much this is? Yeah, I'm looking for something under $30. How's it going?
Great, couldn't be better. Fine, how are things with you? Not bad. I can't complain. Do you really want to know? How are you feeling? Great, never better. I'm all right. Like I need a vacation. A little depressed. Really awful. How was your day? Really good. Pretty uneventful. Very productive. Super busy. A total nightmare. Did you like the movie? It was fantastic. It was terrible. It wasn't bad. It's one of the best I've ever seen. No, I don't think it lived up to the hype. How was the party? Crazy. It was absolutely packed. It was a good time. Small but fun. There was hardly anybody there. Boring. I couldn't wait to get out of there. Can you give me a hand? Of course. I'd be glad to. Will it take long? Sure, just a sec. Sorry, I'm a bit busy at the moment. What have you been up to lately? I've been working a lot. Mostly studying. I've been taking it easy. Planning my summer vacation. Nothing much. What's the matter? Oh, I'm just having a rough day. I'm not feeling so good. I just found out my mother's in the hospital. I'd rather not talk about it. Nothing, I'm fine. What would you like to drink? Iced tea, please. Just water for me. What do you have? Could we see the wine list? Nothing for me, thanks. Are you ready to order? Not quite. I think we need a little more time. What are the specials today? Yes, I'll have a Caesar salad and then baked chicken with potatoes. Uh-huh. To start off, we'll split an order of nachos. Almost. I just have a couple of questions. Is everything okay? Yes, everything's fine. Thanks. It's all delicious. Could we have some more water, please? Actually, I'm still waiting for my side dish. To be honest, my food is kind of cold. Could you heat it up? Can I get you anything else? Two decaf coffees, please. Just the check, please. Can I have a look at the dessert menu? I'll have a slice of apple pie. No thanks, I think we're just about done. What's your name? My name is Layla. I'm Liam. Where are you from? I'm from France. I come from the U.S. Where do you live? I live in New York. How old are you? I'm 26 years old. I'm 28. When is your birthday? My birthday's on January 21st. What is your phone number? My phone number is 123-456-789. What's your email address? It's Layla123 at gmail.com. What's your job? I'm a student. I work in a bank. I'm unemployed at the moment. I work as a tour guide for a local tour company. What line of work are you in? I work in sales. What company do you work for? I work for an investment bank. 
What religion are you? I am a Christian. What's your marital status? I'm married. I'm single. Are you married? Yes, I'm married. No, but looking for someone nice. Do you have a girlfriend? I have a girlfriend. I'm not dating anyone. How many children do you have? I have two children. I do not have any children. Do you have any siblings? I don't have any siblings. I have two brothers and two sisters. Who do you live with? I live with my wife and children. I live with my parents. What time do you get up? I usually get up at 6.30 a.m. When do you do morning exercise? I often do morning exercises at 7 a.m. What time do you have breakfast? I have breakfast at 7.30 a.m. What time do you go to bed? I go to bed at 12 p.m. What's your hobby? I like playing football, reading books, skateboarding, swimming. I'm also interested in playing guitar. My hobbies are listening to music, dancing, playing tennis, and collecting coins. What's your favorite food? My favorite food is spaghetti. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is green. What's your favorite drink? My favorite drink is beer. What kind of films do you like? I'm really interested in horror and action films. Did you like the movie? It's one of the best I've ever seen. Where do you study? I'm a student at Stanford University. What time do you go to school? I go to school at 7.40 a.m. How do you get to school? I usually take the bus. What's your major? My major is computer science. Question. Why do you study English? Because it's very important and necessary. Because I love to improve my English skills. What do you want to do after you graduate? I would like to be a software engineer. I want to be a programmer. How did you learn English? I took classes for three years. I did an intensive course. I've been studying by myself. I picked it up from movies and songs. My friend taught me. How many languages do you speak? I speak two languages. Can you speak English? I can speak English very well. I can express myself and communicate in English. How long have you been learning English? I've been learning English since I was six. I've been learning English for ten years. Which grade are you in? I'm in eighth grade. Which year are you in? I'm in my third year. I am a freshman. I'm in my final year. Do you have any exams coming up? I've just graduated. What's your favorite subject? My favorite subject is art. What's the weather like? It's raining. It's hot and windy. What's the temperature? It's 24 degrees Celsius. What time is it? It's 4 o'clock. It's half past 3. I'm sorry. I don't know. Let me check my phone. 
What's the date today? 17th of October. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How about you? Not too good, but I'll be okay. Where are you going? I'm going to the store. I need to buy something. What are you going to do today? I'm going shopping. What are you doing? I'm reading a book. I'm washing dishes. Where would you like to go? I would like to go to the zoo. What's the matter? I'm not feeling so good. Nothing. I'm fine. Is there anything I can do to help? Everything will be okay. What's on your mind? I'm just thinking. I was just daydreaming. It's none of your business. What did you do last night? I watched TV. I cooked pasta and soup. What are you going to do tomorrow? I'm going to play volleyball at the beach. What sports can you play? I can play tennis, basketball, and football. Can you give me a hand? No problem. I'm afraid I can't. Could you do me a favor? I'd be happy to help you. Could you give me that book? Sure. Would you mind opening the window? It would be my pleasure. How can I help you? Yes, I'm looking for a sweater. Can I try it on? Sure, the changing rooms are over there. Can I try it on somewhere? The fitting room is in the left corner. What size do you wear? Medium should be fine. What size do you take? I take a size 11. Is that a good fit? It's a little too small. It's just right. Have you got something bigger? Of course, we've got larger sizes as well. How much does it cost? It's $11. How would you like to pay? I would like to pay by cash. Can I pay by credit card? Certainly, we accept all the major cards. Do you need anything else? No, thanks. How are you feeling? Great, never better. Really awful. How was the party? It was a good time. Boring, I couldn't wait to get out of there. Are you ready to order? We need a few more minutes, please. I'd like a cake, please. Would you like chicken or pasta? I'll have the chicken. What would you like to drink? Iced tea, please. Nothing for me, thanks. Did you say save room for dessert? No, thank you. I'm full. Yes, please. Can I see a list? How does it taste? It's delicious. Can I get you anything else? No, thank you. I'm ready for the bill, please. Yes, can I see a dessert menu? What do you think about this event? I really like it. What do you think? Are you here with anybody? I came with my best friend. Have you got a pet? I've got a puppy. How do you do? How do you do? Pleased to meet you. What's this? 
This is a pencil. What does she look like? She's tall and slim with blonde hair. How is she? She's pretty. What's he like? He's very smart and brave. Are you hungry? Yes, I'm hungry. No, I'm full. How do you feel about him? He's quite friendly and helpful. May I open the window? Certainly, it's very hot in the office today. Do you need help? No, I'm good. Thanks for asking. Yes, please, if you don't mind. What do you do every day? I listen to music and play badminton every day. What are you planning to do today? I'm not sure yet. What are you planning to do after work? I'm going shopping with my friends. Are you free tomorrow? Yes, I'm free tomorrow. No problem. We can meet tomorrow. Will you join me for coffee? I'd love to, thanks. Sorry, I'm afraid I don't have time. Could we have lunch together one day? With pleasure. I'd love to, but I'm very busy at the moment. Would you like to have dinner with me? Yes, that would be nice. Where do you want to go? I'd like to go to a Japanese restaurant. Would you like to come to the cinema with me tonight? Sure, I'd love to. Sorry, I can't. I've got other plans. Would you like to play a round of golf this weekend? That would be great. I'd like to, but I'm not free this weekend. How about coming to the barbecue at the tennis club? Sure, that should be fun. Nice of you to ask me, but I've got an appointment. Have you been waiting long? I've only just arrived. Only a few minutes. How do you get to work? I usually drive my car. Is it close to the subway station? Yes, it's very close. How long does it take? It takes half an hour. How often do you ride the bus? Once in a while. Could you tell me how to get to the police station? Take the second road on the right. It's in the middle of the block. Excuse me, is there a bank near here? Yes, there is a bank nearby. I'm sorry, I don't know. What is the best way to the museum? Go across the bridge, turn right. It's on Oliver Street. You could ask the bus driver. Can I speak to Emma, please? Just a moment, please. Certainly, I'm Emma. I'm sorry, Emma's not here at the moment. She's not available right now. When will she be back? She'll be back in 20 minutes. Did you get my message? Yes, I did get your message. Oh, yeah, I think I got something from you. Would you like to leave a message? Please ask her to call me back. How long have you been working here? I've been working here five years. What time does the meeting start? The meeting will start at 9 a.m. What time does the meeting finish? The meeting will finish at 11 a.m. Are you sick? Yes, I'm sick. What are your symptoms? I've got a headache. 
I've been feeling sick. How long have you been feeling like this? For two days. Are you on any sort of medication? I need a sick note. Where's the counter, please? I don't know. Let's go to information. It's over here, next to gate 7. May I have your passport, please? Yes, of course. Here you are. Do you have anything to declare? No, nothing. Just the normal allowance. Do you have any bags to check? Yes, there's this suitcase. Would you prefer an aisle seat or a window seat? Aisle, please. What's the purpose of your trip? I'm here on business. I'm on vacation. Where are you going to be staying? With some friends in the Sheraton Hanoi Hotel. How long are you staying in Hanoi? About two weeks. Could you tell me where gate E is? Go straight ahead. I'm sorry, I don't know. Can I help you find something? Yes, I'm looking for coffee. Could you tell me where the meat is? If you go to the frozen food section, you'll find the meat there. Where can I find the non-fat biscuits? They're in aisle 9. How much would you like? I'd like half a kilo. I'd like 200 grams of meat, please. Can you offer me any discount? I can't offer you that discount. I'm sure I could offer you a discount. Do you need any help packing? I can manage myself. Thank you. Would you like a receipt? Yes. Thanks. That would be great. What time are you open? We're open from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Seven days a week. What time do you open? We open at 9 a.m. What time do you close? We close at 6 p.m. Do you have a reservation? Yes, I do. No, I don't. What kind of room would you like? I'd like a single room, please. May I see your ID, please? Certainly. Here it is. Could I see the room? Your room is on the second floor. Your room number is 401. Do you have a credit card, sir? Of course. How long will you be staying? Two weeks from this Monday. I'm here until the end of the week. Do you have any rooms available for the 14th of April? I'm sorry, we don't have any rooms available. How many places have you traveled to? Well, I visited all the provinces throughout my country. Have you ever been abroad? Yes, I have. I went to Japan last year for a business trip. What do you usually do during your trip? I often go sightseeing, take pictures. Do you prefer traveling by car, train, or plane? I prefer the plane, although it is a little expensive. Do you prefer traveling alone or joining a guided tour? I love backpacking with my friends. What does your mother do? My mother is a teacher. Can you help me? Yes, I can. No, I can't. Where do you want to go? I want to go to the market. What is your friend's name? My friend's name is Akash. Are you coming with me? No, I'm not interested. When will you go? I will go by Sunday. What were you doing there? I was buying vegetables. Can you hear me?
No, I can't. Yes, I can. Who is your friend? John is my friend. Are you with me? Yes, I am with you. Where do you live? I live in Mumbai. How do you go to market? I go to market by bike. Why are you crying? Because I'm upset. Are you there? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Where are you going? I'm going for a morning walk. Are you angry with me? Yes, I am angry with you. When will you come? I'll come on Tuesday. Do you speak English? Yes, I do speak English. Whose book is this? This is my book. Do you like me? Yes, I like you. Whose bag is this? This is Tom's bag. When do you usually come home? Usually I come home by 10 p.m. When will you arrive? I'll arrive by tomorrow. What does your father do? My father is a doctor. Won't you go? No, I will not go. What do you do? I am a student. I am a doctor. Won't you come? No, I will not come. What are you doing? I'm reading books. Why are you tired? Because I had a lot of work. Do you know him? Yes, I know him. No, I don't know him. Whom do you want to see? I want to see Mr. Jane. What are you doing here? I'm here for buying fish. Why are you shouting? Because I'm angry with you. How old are you? I'm 25 years old. Why are you sad? Because I have got bad marks in the exam. How do you go to school? I go to school by bus. Why are you laughing? Because I'm happy. Are you happy? Yes, I'm very happy. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from the office. How do you go to the office? I go to the office by train. Why are you going to Delhi? I have an exam there. What is your name? My name is Layla. What's going on here? Nothing special. Have you done this before? Yes, I have done this before. Why are you coming to my office? I have a meeting there. What's your name? My name is Layla. Where are you from? I'm from London. Where do you come from? I come from New York. What is your surname? Brown. What is your family name? My family name is Brown. What is your first name? My first name is Layla. What's your address? I stay at 13 United Street. Where do you live? I live in England. What's your telephone number? My number is 345-678. What's your email address? You can email me at layla at gmail.com. How old are you? 38. I'm 38 years old. When and where were you born? I was born in 1999 in London. Are you married? No, I'm single. Yes, I am married. What do you do? I'm an English teacher.
I teach English at the high school. Where did you go? I went shopping with a friend. What did you buy? We bought some new clothes on sale. Where were you? I was in London for the weekend. Have you got a car? Yes, I've got a hatchback. Yes, I drive a sedan. Have you got a house? No, I live in a flat. Have you got any children? Yes, I've got three children, two boys and a daughter. No, not yet. Can you play tennis? Yes, I can play tennis. No, I play football. Can you speak English? No, I can't speak Chinese. Yes, I can, but I'm not fluent. I'm learning to speak English. Could you speak English when you were five years old? Yes, I could speak English when I was five years old. No, I couldn't. English is not my native language.